Hey, how's everyone doing? This is my second video. I'm going to be playing some Rome Total War. I play the Julii. Um, my startup is pretty traditional. I, I did put some cavalry on the left and on the right. Just as a flanking force. So yeah, I decided I'm going to be playing um, basically every Total War game. I have all of them. Except for Shogun 2, that is. I'm going to get it soon. So I'll be posting videos of every game, not just Empire and Napoleon. So, yep. As you can see, I am moving up my archers. Oh, he has some peltist. Some cavalry, royal pikemen right there. So I'm gonna play a bit defensive. Um, just try to pressure with my cavalry, try to get him to react a little bit. Um, I tried to draw him on the left side with his cavalry, he has three units, I have two. Uh, to see if he would do anything, and then try to draw him out on the right side, isolate my cavalry to see if he'd react. I did upgrade my cavalry, uh, just a bit. So I draw him to my two on the left, still pouring down some fire on his main force. Very effective archers on a uh, pikeman. And uh, then send in my other force, cavalry, and uh, route him. So I just routed three of his cavalry. Just a big blow to him, and then he attacked me over here on the right side. I routed his cavalry. So I have superior position uh, now. Gonna get on his flank, and the only cavalry he's gonna have is his general. So this forces him to react on the left side. I uh, just try to retreat, but he's gonna feel unsecure on his. Uh, his flanks. So I send in my guys a little bit just to take out his focus. And my bad, he, he actually didn't have any archers, which is a big problem for him. Um, he only had Peltus. So he goes in with his entire army. I try to stay back, I retreat a little bit. Tactical retreat. And as you can see, I still have all my cavalry back there. Didn't really give them an assignment right now because I was micromanaging. So I'm retreating my force uh, because if my if my uh, infantry went up against his spears they would just cut my guys to pieces so I kind of cut his guys off right here and uh, try to force him to fight and then uh, he comes back with all his troops. I run my cavalry right into his royal pikemen and uh, these guys right into his cavalry. So as you can see I'm still pouring fire and I just got a magazine. Pelt is still pouring fire. I mean the big difference in this battle besides the Cavalry in the beginning, definitely with my archers. So I do not want a, a direct confrontation with those. 
So I got some peltist, um, a little bit of cavalry, and some infantry. I'll try to charge in just to sweep up some of this infantry with my cab. But definitely try to avoid those spears. And I kind of let my infantry rest in the back, as you can see. Just send my cavalry in to do some work. And let my, imp or let my uh, archers do a lot of work, actually. Let's see, I still have cavalry out there. Kind of waiting. For him to forget about them. I'm just kind of slowly coming back, letting my guys pick him off. And he's just chasing. So he's still got a pretty formidable force after all of that. And uh, especially those spears, those spears are just lethal. route some of my infantry, but I end up routing his cavalry. And, uh, send them between a pike unit and his cavalry, my cavalry. And, uh, so I'm just trying to pick him off, retreat a little bit, pick him off with my arrows. You can say it's a new strategy, but it's effective against spears. He's still got a pretty formidable force, as do I, and I still have my cavalry out there. And that's a big advantage. He tries to route that unit, but I end up coming in with my cavalry and just decimating his troops. He tries to come in with his spears, and I come in with one of my units, cavalry, actually two in the back, and... Uh, Tries to lay some spears into him. I just I lose a lot of men in that charge, but I, I'm able to route his spearmen, which is what I was trying to do in the first place. The gods be I'm able to kill his general the there, general and dead. then I send in my infantry, to try to mop him up, approaches. try to route all of his units. And, uh, and I have full route. So basically, uh, cavalry played a big part, especially that initial the skirmishing in the beginning. I was able to defeat his cavalry real quick, and uh, he had to play almost mm, not super aggressive, but I was trying to take him out with my archers, and he had to had to play somewhat aggressive, and uh, I was able to defeat him. So, yep, let me know what you think, and uh, thank you for watching.